introduce yourself i am jitesh singh i am from riva currently i am living in indore i done my graduation from rgpv university i currently i am doing one stack training from shiva concept solution indore my hobbies are watching cricket and workout okay okay uh, do you know about uh, what is the mar stack can you explain me what is the mar sir mar in mar stack m is stand for mongo db e stand for express r stand for react and n stand for, uh, n stand for node js uh node js uh, is back end language and express is used for making uh, apis which connected front end to back end rest is front end uh, react is front end and m is mongodb which is database what is uh, the hooks concept in react js sir hooks are function that allow us to use state and other react feature in a functional component it was introduced in 16.8 version of react hooks provide a provide a way to provide a way to manage component state and other uh, other life cycle events in a functional component they enable us to state they enable us to make stateful logic across the component that makes easy to test or and hooks call implicit or explicit sir hooks call implicit implicit call. yes sir okay inside loop we can call hooks no sir sir there are two condition to call loops uh, first is it should be called in top and it should not be called in inside the nesting function or loops or condition okay. second is it should be called in <coughs> function tell me the name of uh, hooks that is equivalent to component did mount component did mount it is equivalent to component did mount component did mount uh, sir use effect yes use, use effect, effect to hook you what is the difference between use effect and use layout effect sir use layout is actually a synchronous uh, synchronously run and it runs uh, before uh, loading of this uh, before loading of the view and use effect uh, load after the view so uh, that means it uh, takes a little bit uh, different time difference we cannot easily get it but use effect means this is this is this is earlier use layout sir effect. use layout effect uh, earlier. earlier and use, use effect is run after okay. and uh, tell me the five hooks name sir five hooks name use state okay use effect yes. use memo Yes. Use ref. Okay. Use callback. Okay. Use memo. You have used. Yes, sir. What is the work of it? Sir, use memo uses to memorize the value, preventing unnecessary recomputation of the value on every render. This is used for. It is used for optimize the performance and cache the result for the expensive uh, calculation until the dependency changes. Okay. 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 What is the React life cycle? Can you tell me? Sir, React life cycle is a process of mounting, updating, and destroying a component in a React application. In React life cycle, each component has three main phases: mounting, updating, and unmounting. Mounting, rendering, or putting React element into the DOM is called mounting. It has four built-in method. First is constructor. Second called get derived from props. Third called render. Fourth called component did mount. and after the mounting if there are any changes in props and state we are called updating method it has five built in method first was called in get derived from state second called component did mount did update sorry sir component did update third will called render method fourth one called get snapshot okay. before update that's that's suppose that we have two component first a component and second is a b component okay i want to pass the data from a component to b component then what approach we will follow sir we can use props okay props to pass the data from one component to a component to b component another approach. Uh, sir another approach we can use contest to okay. it is also used to pass the data from one component to, to another component sir. so what is the difference between use context and props sir props uh, like uh, use uh, when we pass the data from props in it pass one by one if okay. like if you want to pass data from component a to c it will not pass it passed from a 
B and then C. Okay. In contest API, we can directly pass. It will create global variable in contest hook. Sorry, sir. In contest hook, it create global variable which can pass direct from component A to component C. Okay. Uh, what is the difference between fetch method and exos? Sir, fetch met method is. Uh, uh, default method of, default method of a browser okay. and uh, exosis method is uh, we can uh, in exosis method it provide better security as compared to fetch method okay. and uh, in fetch method uh, there are ST stp modules which has five method uh, and we can like stp metal it is uh, get put update delete and in Exorcist, it is also STP method, but it provide easy to handle and it provide better security as compared to fetch yes, method. Suppose that uh, I have uh, JSON format data. Yes, sir. Okay. And I am using Exos. Then JSON Karmajar is required or not? No, sir. In Exos, it is not required. It automatically converts. It is automatically convert, but in fetch, it is required. Suppose that you want to call 10 API at a time. Then which is better? Exos are better or fetch are better? Sir, in this case, Exos is better as compared to fetch. As compared to fetch. But fetch runs uh, fast as compared to Exos. Fetch runs faster as compared to Exos. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. What is Redux? Sir, Redux is JavaScript library which is used to distribute the project on a different project layer. We can easily manage large and complex project using this library. Uh, it is also debug the application easily. It has four different layer: view layer, action layer, store, and reducer. Okay. Store is a sir, center repository that holds the application state. We can create a store by using create store function from Redux. Sir, action is a JavaScript object, plain JavaScript object. That describe the uh, that describe the event or intention to change the state. They have type property which describe the type of action being performed in the action. Okay. And reducer uh, reducer are pure function, which are transforming the state on the based of action. Action, uh, sir. It it takes a current state and action uh, into uh, and return it into a new state object. Means it is used for communication between, uh, uh, I think, that actions and stores. Stores, where intermediate. intermediator for as an intermediator. Okay. You have used Redux in your project? Yes, sir. I have. I have done a, uh, a to-do list in a Redux. To-do list task, task done. done in Redux. Okay. Okay. Your confidence skill is best. Okay. Some improvement is required a little bit in definitions part. Yes, okay, and some practical exposure also you should add it in your definitions. Okay. You first define it and you should try to define in short because you are defining in very depth manners. Okay. Okay, so it is very time consuming for interviews. Yes. You, you can say very very, very uh, short and sweet definitions yes. Okay, yes. with practical implementations. Okay, so this improvement is required, otherwise remaining is best. Okay, but in Node.js part, you should improve lots of things. Yes, okay. sir. There are many uh, incorrect definitions you have defined. Two yes. or three questions you have defined wrong. Yes, okay. sir. These questions you should improve. Yeah.